two brothers were separated at such a young age, they didn't even know about each other until the brother living in Peabody took a DNA test and found out he had another sibling. Overjoyed to find one another, the coronavirus now delays their reunion. Tonight, WBZ's Julie McDonald has their story. When I first got it, I said, oh, that's, that's nice. Thank you very much. Uh, but it took me a couple of months to even get around to, to spitting in the tube and sending it in. At 80 years old, you'd think Mike McDonald of Peabody may have seen it all. But late last year, the gift of a DNA kit gave him the surprise of his life. Within an hour, the message came back. She says, you are my grandfather's brother. Born in Stoneham, Mike was adopted as a baby. He grew up in Concord. My dad was a pediatrician. So um, we had, you know, of course, the, the best medical care. Yeah, my mom was terrific. She was a wonderful person. She just, she just passed away. Gosh, it's, oh, it's 15 years ago now, but she was, she was almost 95. He'd wondered a little where he came from. Turns out for several decades, a man now in Georgia also wondered about him. When we first made contact, he said, you know, I always had the feeling I had an, a brother. Mike and older brother David Dyke plan to meet next month. Of course, COVID-19 changed that. Given our ages, I hope we last long enough. After a lifetime apart, they're enjoying every conversation. A missing piece of each other's stories and hearts finally recovered. He's gotten to feel like an old friend, uh, both he and his wife. It would have been nice if we could have somehow made the connection earlier than, than this. But as I say, I'm just thankful that we both, uh, the good Lord has both um, has let us both live long enough to at least see this much. Julie McDonald, WBZ News.